Hello everyone. Welcome to Skytech Academy, a structural software training institute where you learn lots of practical engineering concepts. So in previous session, we had discussed about load transfer mechanism. And in another session, we had discussed about load acting on structures. That means various types of loads acting on a structure. So the links for those videos you will find in the description. And in this session, we are going to discuss about how the loads are applied or the units in which the loads are applied on a particular element. So here we go. Load application, that means input unit in analytical 2D plan model only. That means I am talking about the analytical model in horizontal plane. If I consider a horizontal plane, then my superstructural element, which are slab, beam and column will be as classified as slab will be area element, beam will be linear element and column will be your point element. So hence the slab is area element. Therefore, all the load applied on a slab should be in unit known as kilonewton per meter square. If I consider beam, then beam is linear element, then all the loads applied on it should be in kilonewton per meter if that load is uniformly distributed. Otherwise, that load can be applied as point load. Like if a secondary beam is resting on a primary beam, then the reaction from the secondary beam will act on, as a point load on main beam. That time the load input unit will be kilonewton. Therefore, these are two possibilities of load input unit that is kilonewton per meter and kilonewton. But you cannot apply kilonewton per meter square as a load on beam. Similarly, if I consider column, then column is a point element. Therefore, all the load coming on it or all the loads which are to be applied on column should be in unit known as kilonewton. So that's all from our side for today's session. This was the third basic concept explained from our side. First one, first basic concept was explained in the previous video that was load transfer mechanism. Second basic concept was various types of load acting on structure. And this is the third concept. Third load basic concept is the input unit in analytical model. So if you liked our video, then please like, share with your friend and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more such kind of practical engineering concepts. Thank you for watching our video. Thank you.